In today's video, we're gonna fly this awesome little UMX A10. One of the best things about it, not only the fact that it flies really well, is that it comes in the box like this. You don't have to piece anything together. But if you're here, and you're here within about a week or so of the release of this video, congratulations, because you probably just saved a whole lot of money. We're gonna fly this, we're gonna have fun in the video, but also know that because of the contacts that I have in the industry, I know what is about to happen in the industry. And remember, we've been talking about prices going up. And unfortunately, we are seeing prices of really everything going up, but things may be about to go up a bit more. So if you've had your eye on any RC, uh, now would be the time to buy it. If you don't have the cash sitting there, a lot of these websites offer payment systems in place. I would take advantage of that because what's about to happen is you're gonna save some money, okay? By buying it. I, I, I think buying I, it now rather than later. That's right, yeah, because it's about to happen. So do us a favor, please, please, please do us a favor. If we're saving you money, and we are, <laughs> Use the links that we have in the description box below that'll take you to one of your favorite websites that you have purchased from on our channel in the past before. And then two or three weeks from now, when you see what's happening, you're gonna come back to our channel and you're gonna kiss your phone, you're gonna say, thank you, Nate, for saving me a big old chunk of money. And having said that, uh, let's fly. ran back <laughs> this is why we love umx planes they come in the box completely in one piece and they just work right out of the box now i think look at the birds chasing me <laughs> i think this plane looks best with the landing gear off but the landing gear does work well now i i don't think you can take off from the grass look at all the birds oh my gosh they're attacking you <laughs> oh my goodness i had safe one for the launch because when you're going to hand launch something if you can take advantage of safe you might as well the birds are just chasing me <laughs> It's so awesome. They really are. They're trying to figure out what I am. And I, they can't keep up though. <laughs> I don't know if Abby can keep up either. Birds, look out! I do not want a bird strike in today's video. <laughs> oh Have you guys ever hit a bird while flying? I haven't. But I feel like... This you hit, you hit a bee with a drone one time. Yeah, I remember I that. that. I just destroyed that bee, that poor thing. It's an accident. It was. That's well, the bee's fault. It was the bee's fault. It was my fault. <laughs> Flying in his own space. <laughs> <clears throat> so the UMX A10, you guys, uh, it's very cool because it's kind of like the little UMX Citation, um, but it's been reworked from the old UMX A10, which was the gray one, and it now is more durable, more robust. Ooh, sorry. Uh, I got a man blind with me too. And just the performance is better. I think we also have uh, telemetry. We, and we have safe now, which we didn't have on the old UMX. We still had AS3X, but not, uh, not safe. And safe is nice. Helps get the beginner in the air, which Gary Z, my buddy, is kind of a beginner. He's starting to get in that intermediate zone. And I think he picked one of these up and he messaged me, because he's a friend, and said, hey, Nate, how do I get the battery out of here? I said, Gary, don't, don't put it in as far. <laughs> That's how. And then, uh, pro tip for everybody is, you do not have to cover your entire battery with Velcro. You can just put a little patch of Velcro and it's gonna mostly get the job done, depending on what you're flying, of course. Let's go for a loop. About half throttle loop. That was nice. Nice, nice. Abby, you've flown this. It's a great little bird, isn't it? Oh, it's fun. If yeah. for its size, it books it. But oh, I'm not even like here. Let's go safe mode on. Yeah, with safe, it was then, like super and awesome. And I'm going to go full throttle. <laughs> I like how it sounds just like a... I don't know, it's so high pitched, you know? Just oh yeah. Brushless motors in there. Okay, let's go full throttle again. It's pretty fast. I missed it. <laughs> it's really I fast. should have zoomed out. <laughs> we'll come by again. Let's go. It's super cool. Such a cool plane. I mean, it's really, really scale looking. And a uh, smaller plane like this, you can fly in a smaller space. You don't have to have much more space than a soccer field. Fly this in a soccer field, no problem. Love this little plane. So what I was talking about, guys, this video is kind of like a hidden message, you know, within a video. I didn't want to just make a video saying, hey, um, everybody, 
might want to buy your planes right now. I still wanted to fly something. And this applies, guys, I know we have- I know we have ground vehicle guys that watch our videos because they like to watch airplanes, but they just haven't pulled the trigger. This applies to ground vehicles too, okay? It's not just- It's everything, every it's everything. website basically. And it's, <laughs> it's already happened on a lot of sites, and it but could it's happen, about to get worse, I think. It will happen more. It's not yep. think, it's not if, it's going to. So listen, if you have an airplane that you've been eyeing, that's you know maybe a couple hundred dollars, it might be about to become 230, maybe 250. So this And really that's is... all my favorite planes, man. That's not... Yeah, I know that price range, me too. Yeah. yeah, I know. Yeah. I mean, I like my big $500 airplanes, but you know, they're you just have, for me, I have more fun flying the little sub $200 airplanes. Me too. If you crash it, you don't have as much Whoa. as much impact. Yeah, <laughs> didn't expect that. Airplane. You don't have as much uh, devastation. What about some inverted? Uh, okay. With this. Mm, okay. <laughs> now you yeah, can't I'm speak. Doing it, I'm doing it. <laughs> you can't talk, nope, Meg. Nope, nope, safe. <laughs> safe. Save me. It saved me totally. Totally saved my UMX A10. Cha cha cha. Actually, <laughs> this is the Burt plane. Why do I never wear my Burt shirt? Ugh. I have a UMX A10 Burt shirt and I never wear it when I fly my <laughs> A10. Ugh. Have you guys noticed he doesn't wear his, you have a shirt, something about crashing and style. I don't wear it anytime. He, if he wears it when he flies, he does crash. Yeah, it's, funny. Two, it's two, it's two for two. He will only wear it in play or in car videos now. Or, <laughs> or boats. doing yard work or, <laughs> or something yeah. like that. I don't wear it to fly my planes. Because <laughs> yep. seriously, it is, I don't know if you want to look at it as two for two or oh for two. You're at five minutes. But it will crash. I crash my planes when I wear that shirt. That's it. <laughs> This is just a really fun little plane. And you know, by this, I don't know if this one's going to go up in price, but a lot, a lot of things are about to. And so please use the link because this, you know, I, I, I assume you wouldn't have known that if not for tuning in here. If you already knew that, do your thing. And it just supports us guys. It just supports us. It's kind of like a two way street. You know, we, we do our best to get the videos out there but we can only do this with your all's support. And I think most of you know that, but this is a really good opportunity to take advantage of that. I mean, we'll, we'll sometimes come out around Christmas time uh, with a coupon code or something, um, but this is bigger than that, actually. This is, like, this is like everything. So it doesn't have to be this airplane. Our links will take you to the website, or the websites, rather, and, um, uh, you know, it doesn't have to be this A-10. You, you might you might be eyeing the Aero Scout, we'll say. Or maybe you're eyeing uh, the Bigfoot, okay? Now, the Bigfoot just went up in price. We just flew it recently. It did go up about $30. But I'm, it's kind of the things I'm talking about, giving you a bit of an indication on what may be happening, uh, could save you quite a bit of money. So, um, Abby, we do have telemetry on this. I can keep flying. I, if I remember right, we were getting about 10 minute flights on this. Yeah, so you're in about seven put, minutes. Go, go, go. Meow. Meow. There it is. <laughs> you just had to there. juice it. Yeah. See, I can get a 10 minute flight because I don't fly like you do. So. <laughs> right, you always right, get a shorter flight. Oh my, we're you were fast. in the grass and done. Oh, the, oh. <laughs> the pilot was ejected. That's what happened. He meant to do that. <laughs> But there you have it, the UMX A10. It is a very awesome little bird that just comes like this out of the box and you bind it to your radio. You don't have to set up safe or anything. It's already assigned to a switch if you pair it up with a nice spectrum radio and it just works exceptionally well out of the box. I feel like now is a great opportunity to tell you guys about this. I, I just got a comment yesterday from somebody that watches our videos regularly and they recently signed up to AMA, them and their buddy, the Academy of the Model Aeronautics. The Academy of Model Aeronautics, not the. <laughs> the Facebook. The MySpace. The RC Sailors. Well, we are the RC Sailors. We should drop the the. Anyway, uh, AMA, <laughs> unfortunately, had to step in. And I like talking about this because it's good to know that they will. So apparently, said commenter and his friend were flying and his friend was fairly new to flying and they unfortunately flew through a neighbor's window. Now, 
because they were abiding by AMA's guidelines. Now, the reason that happened was a receiver failure. According to them, it could have been a gust of wind, could have, but it was a receiver failure according to the commenter, and that made the airplane go through a neighbor's window. The neighbor wasn't mad. They got everything all sorted out, okay? And AMA did step in to help cover those costs. I think there's a deposit and that sort of thing. But thank goodness they had AMA. And that's what they said. Thank goodness they had AMA. And if it wasn't for watching our channel, they would not have known about AMA. So it worked. It, they stepped in and, and did what they were supposed to do. That's cool. So we helped them save money, basically. Yes. <laughs> and unfortunately, we cost AMA money, but, but also... That's what they're there for. I think they'll be a lifetime member and probably, you know, it'll all work out in the well, end. Well, that's cool. I'm glad to know that. I yes. didn't know that. No, I didn't tell you that. Yeah. I, I read a lot of comments that you don't. <laughs> Uh, so that's really cool to know, and I think that because of this, this price increase that's coming to a lot of things, you're going to possibly see some newer people in the hobby flying, right? If you've never bought an airplane before and you're like, now's the time, I'm telling you, now's the time, unless you like paying more, um, you're going to buy your first airplane possibly. And if you do, just pair it with AMA, okay? Get the Academy of Model Aeronautics. This plane will be linked in the description box below. Very important to know. Some of our favorite websites are gonna be linked down there too. Now's the time to buy it. It doesn't have to be this. You're gonna go straight to the homepage on the website, buy your plane you've been wanting, your battery you've been wanting, your charger, whatever. You might need 10 things. Trust me, buy them now. It's about to happen. So if we save you money, come back a couple weeks from now and just say thanks. And while we're on thanks, I wanna thank God just for letting us get in front of the camera and do this. It's awesome, and I, I like being able to be the person to save you money when we can. I just love sharing this hobby with people, the whole thing, from start to finish. I love it, so thank you, God, and also a massive thanks to our Patreon supporters because you guys actually financially support what we do, and that's everything from fuel in the gas tank to get us to the locations where we go to do our videos to buying batteries for our cameras. I mean, we talk about the RCs all the time, but you fuel everything behind the scenes and I wanna say thank you. We'll have another video, Abby flying the UMX A10, popping up right about now. Thanks for watching, we'll see you there. Bye.